Hey everyone, my name is Terry G. Thanks a lot for stopping by. This is my alcohol free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. If you can take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel and take another second and hit that like button? I'd really appreciate it. Wow, what a morning. You know, I woke up this morning on the wrong side of the bed, on the wrong side of the bed. I'm doing a video in the parking lot before I go into work because sometimes when I drive to work, I get my best ideas. And today, it wasn't really an idea. It was just the way my morning went. You know, I woke up with a tightness in my chest a little bit, feeling very anxious, feeling very overwhelmed, a lot of fear, a lot of worry going on. And a lot of it came from, was generating about future expectations. I'm planning a wedding. There's a lot of issues. Not There's a lot of good things with planning that wedding, but it's an off the grid cottage. So there's a lot of extra things that I have to think about thinking about financial difficulties that I may incur down the road because of that. I'm thinking about the guests, are they all gonna show up? I'm thinking about all this stuff in the future going on that's making me feel stressed and anxious and overwhelmed. And I'm saying to myself, Terry, what are you doing? I'm destroying my day. Because really, today, nothing is really going on today. My life today, as I'm speaking to you in this video, is pretty good. There's nothing, there's nothing really going on. I woke up this morning, I walked the dog, I started to pack as we're going up to the cottage this weekend, but I started thinking about things in the future. In, you know, in a month down the road or six months down the road, how am I gonna do that? Or, you know, is everybody gonna be happy? Are they all show up on and on and on? And before you know it, I'm over, you know, I'm anxious, I'm feeling depressed, I'm feeling hopeless, and it just made my morning crummy. And that's what I'm trying to tell, we'll talk to you in this video. The example I want to give is that, you know, I went to a psychiatrist years ago and he said to me, he doesn't believe in the 12 steps of Alcoholics Anonymous, doesn't really believe in the methods of, of recovery that I, that I believe in. But he said, this one day at a time thing is really good. It's really good. It really works. And he says, you, you guys really got something with this one day at a time. And I believe that keeping life very simple and trying to focus on what we're doing in that moment and in that day helps us cope with life one day at a time and we're not talking just about alcoholics here people regular people can get overwhelmed and anxious about things to come or our mind wants to figure out how it's going to all play out and you know we're figuring all these scenarios in our bed overnight and how it's all going to play out in the future but we can't really do that we're not mind readers. We can't predict the future. We, we can't do that. We just have to go with it and have some faith that things are going to work out one day at a time. And when I came into early sobriety, I had the same problem, always projecting in the future. How am I gonna stay sober over Christmas? What about my start dating and the girl drinks? All those sort of things, all those sort of scenarios. What about that court case? All this kind of stuff going on and all I did is ruined my day. And I'm telling you, it's a very, very hard thing to practice. Talking about it, having a higher power, some spirituality, a little prayer meditation, in the hope, in the belief that things will work out in the future. But no matter what happens in the future, no matter what, I'm going to be okay. I've been sober for many, many years. I've had this problem before of, you know, projecting into the future many months or many, you know, years in the future sort of thing that I'm never going to have enough and it's never going to work out and life's going to be crummy when I turn 60 and 65. I'm not going to have enough money and all that kind of stuff. Nothing ever, ever came to fruition. Nothing ever came true, ever, that I was worried about. Worrying is just borrowing trouble. Worrying just takes away our day and kills our joy for today. It's a human condition. We're going to be there. We're going to think about the future, especially when the big events are coming up. But when it comes to sobriety, we really need to stay in the day and take things one day at a time. That's all anybody can really handle. If you're feeling overwhelmed, you're feeling anxious, you're feeling fearful or worried about the future, you need to talk to somebody about that. What's going on? lean on people and tell people you're afraid and tell people what is going on in your life and people 
will help you and they'll support you through it. It's very normal, not just for addicts or alcoholics. It's normal. We all want things to run smoothly and we all fear or worry about the future sometimes and feel that sensation of being overwhelmed. But when we add in tomorrow or a week down the road, we will feel overwhelmed, okay? So that's what this video is about. Just keep it a day at a time. Don't worry about the future. Do the best you can with what you have to work with today. It's like the old saying said, save your pennies and the dollars will add up. Have a good day and the good weeks will add up, the good months will add up, and the years will add up. Those things that we worry about or have these built up expectations of the past about ourselves or people, places, and things are not at all gonna turn out the way we think. Usually, my experiences, my experiences, uh, things turn out a whole lot better than I can imagine. The thing is, is to suit up, stand up, and show up to those events. Don't get involved with, with the, the worry and the expectations. Step aside, let life unfold the way it's supposed to unfold in your life. Alcoholics, we wanna control things, we want the answers, we want all that kind of stuff, but it's not going to happen. Just take it one day at a time. So that's what this video is about. Stop worrying, stop building expectations up in the future about way things are gonna turn out because I'm gonna tell you something, they usually don't turn out at all the way we think they're going to. And most of the time, they're a whole lot better than we can ever imagine. Life is like that. Life is like that. There's a lot of miracles happening. There's a lot of great things that happen in our lives if we stay sober. If we stay sober one day at a time, we'll be able to handle anything that comes up in our lives, good or bad, okay? So, you're, you're, I'm your, my worst enemy today and I gotta get away from myself sort of thing. This self-centeredness, this, this stuff that drives me crazy, I need to plug into my spirituality, plug into a high po higher, higher power, and plug into some support that people can help me get out of this feeling of being overwhelmed with life and things that haven't even happened. It's all made up right here between my ears, right between my ears, okay? Thanks a lot for stopping by. My name is Terry G. This is an alcohol-free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? Can you take another second and hit that like button? I'd really appreciate it. Again, for stop, thank you for stopping by. Remember, stay safe, stay sober, and together we are strong and together we can stay sober. Lean on each other and reach out and ask for help. You're not alone. Ciao for now. God bless. See you all one day at a time. Thanks for supporting my channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great weekend. It's Friday morning and uh, I'm looking forward to the long weekend here in Ottawa, Canada. Ciao for now.